We are starting our flu clinic uh, vaccination campaign on October 1st. You will be able to walk into the health department anytime from 8 to 11 in the morning and from 1 to 3 in the afternoon for a flu shot. This covers uh, anyone from six months and up until you're 100. Um, we have those vaccines available and um, we bill all insurance, so you'll just need to bring in your insurance card. And then if you don't have insurance, um, the cost of the flu vaccine is $36 this year. And we do have a limited supply of some free vaccine that we're able to give people and stuff if they don't have insurance to pay for it. Our clinic is located at 119 River Drive. Um, we're located right downtown in the Riverfield, almost straight across from the hospital. You can call 437-5500 to get more information on the flu vaccine this year. Um, cystic fibrosis is a chronic genetic disorder and uh, people are born with it and it affects around 30,000 people in the United States. Uh, my son Liam has it and he was diagnosed when he was about a month old from a genetic blood test that was done at the hospital. Um, it affects the lungs and the pancreas and so every day he has to do several breathing treatments. Uh, takes about 30 different types of pills a day just to maintain his health and just to kind of keep him um, alive and healthy and well. So cystic fibrosis is a disease that is unseen. If you were to look at Liam, he looks completely normal. Um, you can't see what is going on with him on the inside. Um, we do try to make his life as normal as possible despite all of the daily treatments and the hours of different breathing therapies that he has to do on the pills but he is around a whole lot of people because of that we let him be involved in sports and he goes to school so it's really important that things are clean that things are uh, safe for him and when I realized the importance of more vulnerable populations it, it made me realize how imperative it is for all of us to do this to make sure that those populations are safe not just us personally. When Liam was six years old, he was hospitalized for a common cold, and he was hospitalized for two weeks and sent home with a pick line, and it was a really big ordeal for him and our family. Had to have a procedure and everything, and so that moment made our family really realize how devastating the disease can be to an individual with it. Even something as simple as the common cold really knocked him out for several months to be honest and we were thankful the whole time that it was not the flu because we know that that would have been even worse and so I really encourage people to think about others in situations who are immune, immunocompromised or have these chronic medical conditions which can really affect them greater than it does us. It's all about protecting those vulnerable populations.